playing some Fallout. I know it's been a while and I haven't started, but here we go. We're gonna continue where we left off of, and that was uh, the High Honey um, Hollow Tape, and we're gonna go to the Commonwealth. Well, I think we are in the Commonwealth. I think that's just what the local area is about. But uh, here we go. Here we go. It's just me today. No one's here. Everyone's off. Chilling on my own. I finally found some batteries. It's like I, I'm like that one dude that goes to the store and never comes back because I went to get milk. But instead of getting milk, I finally found the batteries and I came back. Yeah, see, we're still here in the sanctuary. I can't remember if we have music or not, because it's going to be kind of annoying, because it's kind of dumb, what do you think? It's part of the game, isn't it? This was all paid and soundtrack and all that, that bogus stuff, but, uh, it's whatever I get covered. Damn, why is that thing so close? Can I move this? Yeah, I can. See, that's as far as it goes, like, it's so close, I'm so blind. Stupid. I heard you meet yourself. I'm not dumb. Idiot. Nah, sorry guys. I'm not talking to you. I'm talking to the dudes in the party. It's a live playthrough. So whatever I say is said and done. I want to put the radio on. Can I put the radio on? I don't think the radio works. What is it? Oh, <laughs> was it me? We found out. It's a doggy. Hey, boy. What are you doing out here all by yourself? You want to come with me, though? Okay, then. Let's stick together. I'm good. I don't want any of that. Come on, a mission. We are here to find the find something. Forgot already. Oh, it's rolling, 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 rolling. Woo. Goodbye, wheel. I'll be back for you in two days. that I want that. Let's go. 
Ooh, we got a new jumpsuit. Pull out the shot out. Alright. Fall out. Until you're done. Oh shoot. No more British occupation. I get through that? And he busting up there. I wonder why they're not shooting at me. No more British occupation. I think they're pretty much anything in the can. How the war actually went. I wonder if I would have used a computer if it would have did something different. Or not. Oh, oh. So, here's? Oh, likeness. Yeah, it took years. Oh, locked Wait out. Huh? Ooh, turn off the light. Who's looking at the door? Oh, what the hell? That's weird. I didn't know that. I didn't, I didn't see that. How much you got left in you? So, a switchblade. Bag of cement. I like how these people are fighting for their lives and I'm just looting everything before I even go shoot them. This mural commemorates the many sacrifices of the brave men and women of the United States Armed Forces. From Lexington and Concord to the shores of Iwo Jima. From the Sea of Tranquility to the Anchorage front lines, Americans have fought and died through the ages to secure our nation's freedom. May their sacrifices remind us all that freedom is a privilege afforded to the many yet hard-worn by a noble few. 
And then we ended up on the moon. By glowing people. That dude. Boots up there, damn, that's bright. This is glowing now. Wanna go down there? I'm coming in there! Oh, I'm gonna scan every last one of you! You're nothing! Nothing! I got your back! Move! Ow! Bubblegum? That should heal me up pretty good. Pretty good. Oh, I didn't even reload. Locate the trap settlers. Are they all dead? Did I kill them all? Nah, doggy probably yanked them up. See, the question is how do these people not know that I can kill them? I can kill them easily. Like this. Like this, watch. Oh. Man, I don't know who you are, but your time is impeccable. Preston Garvey, Commonwealth Minuteman. God damn it. Minutemen? So now I'm traveling backward in time. Protect the people at a minute's notice. That was the idea. So I joined up, wanted to make a difference. And I did, but things fell apart. A minute's notice. Now it looks a like I'm the last minute man left. Cops not show up. Who are these people? Just folks looking for a new home. A fresh start. I've been with them since Quincy. Lexington looked good for a while, but the ghouls drove us out of there. A month ago, there were 20 of us. Yesterday, there were eight. Now we're five. It's just me. I wonder where the eight died. Marcy and June. That's all Mama Murphy on the couch. Let's go. And this here is Sturgis. Hey. Ghouls? What are ghouls? Wow. Baby. You really aren't from around here, are you? <sighs> nope. Ghouls are irradiated people. Most are just like you and me. They look pretty messed up and live for a long time. God damn it. But they're still just people. The ones I'm talking about are different. The radiations rotted their brains, made them feral. Huh. They'll rip you apart just as soon as look uh, at you. It. Anyway, we figured Conquer would be a safe place to settle. Those raiders proved us wrong. But, well, we do have one idea. Well, let's hear it. Sturgis, tell her. There's a crashed vertebrate up on the roof. Old school, pre-war. You might have seen it. Well, looks like one of its passengers left behind a seriously sweet goodie. We're talking a full suit of Cherry T-45 power. Cherry? Armor. Military issue. I bet she's red. You said it's Cherry. Hmm. That's some serious protection. Oh, it gets better. Get the suit. You can rip the minigun right off the vertibird. Do that. And those raiders get an express ticket to hell. You dig? Mm. It's a suicide mission. Look, new gal. Don't know what cave you're from? Don't care. But you need to shake off what? the cobwebs and smell the cordite. Well, we're all dead anyway. So here's the deal. That armor's out of juice. Like Probably that. has been for a hundred years. It can be yep. powered up again. You going that? But we're a bit my stuck. My choice has been made. You are my on my hit, look, hit on my list. I'll help if I can. All right, I'll help out. What you'll need is an old pre-war FC, a standardized FC. fusion core. Your high-grade long -term Wouldn't be FFC, battery not used by FC, the military. Would you get standardized? We know right where to find one. But we can't get to that damn thing. It's down in the basement. Down in the basement. Like behind a security gate. 
Look, I fix stuff. I tinker. Bypassing security ain't exactly my forte. You could give it a shot. Oh, wait, is that what I picked up? It says I already have it. Actually, I already grabbed the fusion core. We're set. Well, all right. Maybe our luck's finally turning around. Once you jack the core into the power armor and grab that minigun, those raiders will know they picked the wrong fight. Good luck. I wonder how much these cores are worth. I'm gonna sell them. This Perfect. Destroy all humans. That's what he reminds me of. Where dog come from? Why not? What I expected. Dog meat would we'll find in that little neighborhood. <laughs> no, no, no. Hell yeah. There's no, no. <laughs> something coming, and and it's it's angry. Yep. Crazy. I'm gonna take that stuff on the roof and I'm just gonna leave these people. Shot and disappeared forever. Personal log. United States Army Staff Sergeant Michael Daly. This past Saturday, October 23rd, while en route to West Stockbridge, a vertebrate crashed into the roof of this museum. The cause? EMP following nuclear detonation. Several, in fact. From the intel I've gathered, this was a global event. The co-pilot was killed on impact. Pilot died.
Ooh, hello. Sorry about that stream. My doctor showed up at my house to fix my breathing machine. Oh, I'm so sorry about that. It was injuries a day later. Day after that, Flaherty and Kanawa were shot have, by some uh, scared, uh, desperate survivors. What's it called? Then Brzezanski took off running. My sheep Haven't seen him since. My, uh, now my, uh, it's my turn to go AWOL. I have asthma and my lungs don't open up when I sleep because I'm too heavy. My armor's fusion core is burned out, so I guess so. my soldiering yeah. days are done. Genetic. I'm heading to Boston on foot yeah, nah, she, to see she, if my sister she survived my all this. Away with it. She's got an apartment on Boylston Street. They're gonna, they gave me the wrong one supposedly like Daly, signing five, out. six years ago. Good luck. And God bless America. That's not the one they were supposed to give me. That's probably why I haven't been able to sleep with it. Somebody messed up on an order like four years ago, but we can't really do nothing because. Huh? What do you mean? Just now? I just got back. I'm streaming, dude. I, I forgot and I didn't remember. Yeah. There's nothing we can do. It's just when she, my mom said, oh, there's a lady Boss, outside. We got I put my shirt there. on, I ran to the middle room. Why don't you get down here? Show me that fancy gun up close. I didn't expect company this way. Give me that. Come on, I've got places to be. Or at least random company. She didn't call us. Oh. But, uh... I knew it. What are you gonna put with the the food? Still waiting, asshole. Yeah. Come on, I got you places to be. Oh, do you have tortillas? Brandon's making macaroni and beef, but I don't know if I really want. It. I have a, a box of ham helper, but I don't got much. Get away, <laughs> yeah, I know it's gonna be good. It's just I like Alva, dude. Alva came out of nowhere, dude. Fucking dumb dog. She like she popped up behind me. I was like, who's touching me? Are you still good? It's Alba. March 5th, 2022. When is March 5th, 2022? March? Mom, these expired in March. I know they expired in March. March 4th. I don't know what year we are, what day we are. Oh, so they expired. March 5th, yeah, we're the 28th. Yeah, I'll still eat it, I don't care. The tortillas, they should be fine. There's no mold on them. How about be quiet? Dang. Anyway, like I said, sorry it took me long. My doctor randomly pulled up and stole my baby machine. Now I'll stop here tonight. Hey, dude. <laughs> man, it's like a, yeah, psychotic tendencies. Probably can't even hear him, but it's my imagination. I call him Waco. Waco, Waco. Blacko, blacko. Whoa. I'm dead. Oh. oh lord. Oh lord. Yeah, I'd be more scared of this one. Bro, is he not killing him? Am I tripping out? What the? That's probably I think I broke his back You killed my kill! That's my kill! No. 
Oh, I cleared Concord. Let's go. I got the DLC, so I'm gonna stream the DLCs too. I haven't played, um, well, I haven't played, I think. I'll, I don't know. New Cola. New Cola? There you go. I don't know, I got some, well, yeah. That was a pretty amazing display. I'm just glad you were on our side. Mm-hmm. My side. Stop kidding yourself. You're nothing to me. Hmm. <laughs> you know, you talk like a jerk, but you still helped us out, whether you wanted to or not. Listen, when we first met, you asked about the Minutemen. One thing you should know about us, we help out our friends. So here, for everything you've done, thank you. I didn't do it for the money. Hey, sorry. I'm used to everyone yeah, I brought it being back in. in only for themselves. I came you know, inside the house, stole my shoes. My the other Minutemen. Stupid, I, I, I was like, there's something, something behind me. I felt themselves. it wagging on my you foot, right? I felt her tail touching my leg. We could use the help. And I was like, ain't nobody noticed that big white dog that ran back through <laughs> took my shoe. She looked at me, took my shoe, and walked out. All right, Garvey. My man. Evil creature. Oh, that's wonderful. But there's more. They say animals have no hatred in their heart, but that there? animal. That animal there I've does. Seen it. And I know your pain. Okay, I'm listening. You are a woman out of time, out of hope, but all is not lost. I can feel your son's energy. He's alive. Nothing embarrassing you can say around me. me I've heard it all. Brandon. Hello. I knew it. Please tell me well, where. I, I was just trying to see if you were there. I couldn't hear you. A great. Mama Murphy. It's on the window. Working from Look, kid. No. Mama Murphy, we talked about this. That junk. It's gonna kill you. Well, You're a drug addict. We're all gonna die I eventually. We're gonna need this site. Wait, do I have to follow him now? He's gonna need it too. Well, Brand barrel. What are you gonna make with it? Uh, oh yeah, I'm gonna make ground beef and corn. That's what I'm gonna do. Well, I got two corns. My mom said we didn't have any and she found them. Yeah. Wait, but would you mix it or would you just leave it? Just the corn and the beef, and then the beef is separate. Okay, well, do that way. Uh, we got two two cans of uh, turn it. Let me see, sweet corn. We got bread, but it's real weird. I mean, then the best way possible. So you wanted or no? Corn. We got two cans of corn. Dude, that should be enough corn. Yeah. Ground beef, yeah. That should be enough. 
<laughs> green beef, yo. Where, where do I get green beef, mom? Oh. Yeah, he said yes. He said, uh, throw it at him. Throw it out the window, he'll catch yeah, it. it. Yeah, he wants to cut him and come in. Well, the more the merrier, because I'm trying to eat. He never heard me say none. I like tacos. You just don't like it because I put that that uh, that seasoning in it. I love that seasoning now. Uh, beef and broccoli. Yeah, he's he's waiting for you outside. Are you outside? I'd say if you're enjoying, but honestly, you're just like listening to my life story. So sorry about that. <laughs> Wait, are you outside? You already grabbed it, Brandon. Damn, you're fast. Make this my home. I want to live in a garage. What? He is outside, isn't he? Brandon's out there. Oh, well, she went for you. Still following me, low key. I think they got lost, bro. I be walking, I can be seeing nobody. Sometimes I be thinking this ghost. Are they back there. Like, if I wait, will they like wait with me? Like, what do I do? Like, turn on my headlight. Boom. Out. Yeah, we did. We found out. We found out. Oh, we did. <laughs> I wonder if we can get rid of this tree in the middle of the road. Stupid. Look, look, look. Tree blocked me. I'm finna fist fight it. Watch out. Watch out. Red rocket, red rocket, got a red rocket, red rocket. No, no, never, ever, ever. I might, but that's recorded, so yeah. Before nine. Yeah, cause we be eating too late. I think that's really bad. Even though like, you're still losing weight, but like, low key eating late at night and falling asleep, I feel like shit when I wake up.
It's a clown. Look, he made it. <clears throat> I'm glad you decided to come with us. I should have listened to Mama Murphy all along. Pretty nice place she's found for us. I think we could settle down here. Make it a place to call home. What do you think? Yeah. I used to like living here. Before the war. What do you mean? Before what war? Are you saying... I'm a ghost. I lived here. Over 200 years ago. I, I was frozen or something for most of it. Just woke up a little while I'm finna fight two dogs. Damn. Like one of those old pre-war ghouls. You say you were frozen. Anybody else make it out with you? Just my son. Somebody took him away while I was still trapped. Have you run across anybody with a baby boy? Damn. I'm sorry. But no. I haven't run across any kidnapped babies. I'll definitely keep an eye out for him. Anyway, I am glad you're here. And I hope you don't mind, but I've got another favor to ask. I've had word from a settlement asking for help. They're still hoping you okay the only out chance there? to start rebuilding the Miniman is to show people that the trouble is. Oh, good. I was hoping for a chance to rescue some more <laughs> helpless villagers. It's not that people are helpless. They just need someone to give them a helping hand sometimes. That's what the Miniman is supposed to mm -hmm. be all about. By the way, if you want to help out around here at all, talk to Sturgis. I'm sure he'd be glad for all the help he can get. Sure, let me just stop what I'm doing to talk to you. I'm being sarcastic. Leave me alone. You willing to do some work? What kind of help do you need? Well, for starters, we could use some real beds. We've been sleeping on the ground. What the hell do I look like a freaking... Be glad to help. Carpenter? Okay. Just make sure we can sleep. Mm. There's a workbench over there. Uh -huh. I look like a drunk. Sanctuary. I... Bike's not there. The bike's not there. Inside. If John Joel's dead. That's up to the Lord himself. Mm-hmm. Hey Zeus. You <laughs> shut the fuck up. Man, dude's all up in my ear, dude. What's wrong with you? JC Penny closed a long time ago, didn't it? Yeah. You have a JC Penny card, mom? Yeah. Is that from the mall? Yeah. Honestly, if you want to check, we'll go to the mall. Yeah. I don't know. They're brand new. Dude. They're real. Mm -hmm. These are real credit cards with real numbers. Mm -hmm. I think. Maybe it's the work. We'll go to Corpus to the mall and check out the pennies. Huh? Well, dude, I don't need clothes from there. What well, do, but. Yeah, 
This is a weak arm I'm doing right now. I'll tell you what, Bobby. What? What? You know Clutch is on right now? Yeah, but he's playing offline and he's streaming. Yeah. Seems to be growing well. I wonder why it glitches out. Mine, I don't know about mine, but mine don't do that. Mine's offline, but like, I turn it online sometimes. But everybody goes online sometimes. You send an invite, I'll always either join or I'll stay here. He's playing Vanguard too. Playing zombies. Oh, well, I'm streaming Fallout for today. I'm gonna try to run an uh well not an eight hour stream, that's a little too much for me right now. I'm just fixing my little city. Until the corn and beef is made. Oh I had it a while. Try not to drain all the juice out. Cook. That's what I'm saying. Trip out. Gotta give you a heads up. We gonna play bingo again tonight? Nah, I don't even feel like doing it tonight, but... We're gonna wake or sleep? I literally went to sleep, dude. I went to sleep and I woke up at 5. I'll probably go to sleep again, but damn, dude, I feel like crap. It's the it's the weather. War. The heat be making me sleep. Who's that? Who's that? Who's me? No, I barely started in that watching past uh, past nine or something like that. Spoilers ahead in stream for a movie that's been out for a little bit. Past nine, but uh, that movie trash. I see what they tried to do though. Actually, I really don't like that shit no more. It's dumb. It's not even about cars anymore. It's all action. Like, they got cars in there, don't get me wrong. But, that's literally booty. It's booty. I bet you if, uh, our boy was still alive, what's his name, uh, Paul Walker? That shit would be ten times better. What the hell is that? They're trying to kill me all the damn time. Boy, I'm gonna waste time. Get away from me, little rope. The rope. Oh. Stop it. I'm trying to build. Get away from me. Hey.
true, dude. John Joe been gone for like a week. Tops. Yeah. Ain't no one seen him. Now's your time, Brandon. Go make that big purchase. I don't fucking know I'm talking out my ass. I don't even know what's going on half the time in this world. I be sleeping through weeks like days. The world is my time zone and I go through it in phases. There goes my hero. Chiro, Chiro. Hero. Little trunk, little trunk, little trunk. What's wrong with you? Shut up. Get out my ear. All right, dude. I know where you live. Put it. Right across the street from these nuts. Shut the hell up. Imagine you could just look at like junk brand and just delete it. God gave you the power to delete junk, but not people, just junk. So, like, if it's dirty in your backyard or something, you just look at it and disappear. Yeah. I don't think that's too OP. Just get rid of, like, trash. That's how you protect the planet. You create something that just destroys atoms. Destroys the thought of it even being existing. Yo, dude, I saw someone selling a motorcycle on the internet. Or, um, uh, not a motorcycle, but like a Kawasaki. For like three grand, and it only had a little bit of miles. I was like, what the heck? That makes no sense. I don't, I wonder why bikes sell for so cheap. I don't know, maybe I'm tripping. I've, I've never seen the bike market, so I wouldn't know. Do you want me to build him a bed? Yeah, but sh the fuck won't it set?
Ah! You say? Nothing is a something. I like potatoes. I haven't eaten potato yet. What? speaking this house should fall oh my goodness that looks disgusting imagine all the air that's gonna go through there you're gonna die all they wanted was beds and I built them a mansion well not a mansion but no, I built them a casa I built them a house Book them two little. Oh, only two beds. Well, oh, but this one's good. Six beds. Big issue. Oh, yeah. Oh. Yeah! Someone just pooped themselves. Hurry. That's enough to uh, put a door on it. I'm trying to destroy my walls. Mm, the red door. Ding dong. <coughs> I'm a ding dong ditch you. Hey. That's what I said. Use a rat, use a rat, use a big fucking rat. This is gonna be the more tried part. Let's put it on. Let's put it on. Let's put it on. Sturges. Sturges, you fat hippo. Fuck the people at the same time, you blood. There goes my wheel. 
Hey, Sturgis. I like it. Having a place to it's sleep will improve me. everyone's spirits. What we need now is a reliable source of clean water. Oh. I guess drinking from the river isn't good enough for you. Well, we've been getting by. But the surface water isn't safe to drink regularly. I'm not looking for anything fancy. A well or two would do the trick just fine. I wondered, is that real? If I were to bury a pipe deep enough in the ground, would I find a whale? I got a mission to do. You're gonna see me outside one day just digging a hole. Straight China. Damn, I think I built the freaking mat under the house. I just fuck. Well, I'm spawning under the house, I think. Hey, Sturgis. I feel better already. Knowing we have a reliable supply of clean water. I hope you don't mind me asking for some more help. If we're gonna settle here, we'll need to get some crops established. I'll start planting right away. Good deal. Hmm, weapon. It's pretty dumb, pretty dumb, pretty dumb, 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 Did you know ammonia is good for cleaning a house? Like what? That's what I Mama, he said he said down by the seashore. Why do you always do that? Idiot. Hope Will Smith slaps you. Dude, that's all over the internet. That's all I could see when I woke up. Some people are like, Will Smith is a bitch for slapping him. But then again, I don't know what to say. He didn't slap a dude that was pounding his wife, so... A little joke here at a fucking award show. I think that was a bit much. But I'm sure it wasn't real because Chris Rock took that shit like a champ. Because a real person would have jumped his ass, you know? I don't know. He would have jumped him, dude. I wouldn't have stood there. What the fuck? That's instant wrestle, dude. Otherwise, Chris Rock got some fucking. I don't know. That just. It's so random. Here I thought he was gonna like make a joke or grab like an like a, an award or something, but nah, he fucking went in for the pop, and he walked away like he did some. It would have been funny if, <laughs> if his wife went up there and slapped him. <laughs> hey, he fucking she took that. In. He's a fucking comedian, dude. You should expect that shit. 
They use anything as comedy, even death. You know, keep your wife's name. Wait, your wife? Keep my wife's name. <laughs> your fucking mouth. Uh, I would have been like, yeah, after he slapped me, yeah, live TV. <laughs> it was so fucking stupid. Like, oh no. The fucking award show would have turned into a WWE match. Tonight on Monday Night Raw. <laughs> Will Smith slaps Chris Rock. Chris Rock slithers up behind him out of nowhere. I just can't believe the dude that played as a fish slapped the dude that plays that as a giraffe. I told you I knew who he was though. Like I couldn't remember who you were talking about, but like I was like, I remembered his voice in the back of my head because all I would play was that freaking Madagascar game when I was little. Very young, very young boy. Fudgeicles, I can't find no food. I guess I'm gonna have to venture out because I can't complete the mission. They're under the map. Right? Or is my game broken? My game broken. Oh my son of a gun. Who put the pineapples under the sea? Seems to be growing well. Huh? Why would you do such a thing, you evil person? Who lives in a pineapple under the sea? A wall square pants. He's at all. He what you saw? I know where Elmo lives. You can't stop. Man, I can smell the food now. The food you're making. It's already cooking too. I can hear it. You fat some. What are you playing? Vanguard. Ha. 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 He's alive. Your cousin's on too. Here goes my Adelaide. No name. Hey, don't don't say that's a sin. Uh, not yet, but if it's what I think it is, I shouldn't have to watch it. I'll go down to shit next, I'm gonna like this. I don't wanna do that. I guess here we go, we're going to Ten Pan number look. I invited him, so if he doesn't join, that's his own accord. I'm 
we found out. No, I didn't. We found out and blessed his soul. Check my Twitch real quick, cause I I didn't have my broad my uh, my thingy thing open. So I can see what people are doing, or if they're even talking, or if there's somebody here, so I can greet them. Greet them, Steven. Greet them, greet them. So that one viewer watched me. Thank you, thank you very much. You've been watching me, I don't know how long. I don't know what your name is, but thank you. Currently heading to Ten Pines Bluff. On this path that used to be a road, but I'm gonna ignore it because I'm a cool kid and I walk on the rocks. Ticket? Ticket or ticket? <laughs> Damn, that hurt! Imagine if everything you ever listened to was in a, a stream. I'd hate my life. Oh yeah, did you hear about it? The Walking Dead's are about to finish already. Finally, it took them so damn long. Yeah, it's pretty trash, dude. I got bored. Like that takes a lot, and I love zombies, and that that really pissed me off. Once they killed most of the people I liked off, they literally killed the main dude. You know how the fuck do you do that? Huh? Like, they killed Rick, they killed fucking uh, his wife, they killed, uh, what was his name? Uh, the other cool cop dude, but Rick didn't like him because he was fucking his wife. Shane? Yeah, I think that's him. Yeah. And, um, they killed Carl, his son, which I thought that literally, I don't know. Dude got shot in the eye and he dies by a little bite trying to save somebody. Are you serious? Hey, what do you want? We don't need any more trouble around here. Now, I remember the Take first season. I was like I'm with the 10 Minute years Men. old watching that at my grandma's house on the box You're TV. You're with the dude. Minute Men? I didn't really think you fellas that, still existed. That thing was dope. I sent word with one of them passing traders, but honestly, I never expected anything to come of it. It was the best thing on TV at the time. The if I remember correctly, everybody was watching it. Bad business, that. All right. We're rebuilding the Minutemen from the ground up. We nah, are the good guys wow. again. Glad to hear it. No question that things have been worse since the Minutemen fell to pieces. There's a raider gang that's been giving us trouble for weeks. Stealing food and supplies, threatening to kill us all if we don't pony up. We Damn. There's a lot of people. We know where they're coming. Nah, don't worry, I'm playing we Fallout. We can't go up against a gang like that. Don't worry. I'll take care of those raiders for you. Thanks, friend. If you folks are for real this time, it'll how be a welcome doing? change for the better. Huh? How you guys doing, huh? Yeah. Fortnite? <laughs> yes. Fortnite though, right? Okay.
10 days, dude. You're tripping. And to that one dude watching the stream, thank you. I don't know what you're doing, but thank you. Oh shit! Oh, that means you don't have any loot. Guys, you gotta turn that real, real weird. I don't know what that is. Super duper mark. Yeah, you probably got stripped throat because if you had COVID, you wouldn't be talking. Yeah, you can. Look in the mirror. Who hit you? Oh, shoot. Yeah. <laughs> That's a little dangerous, I think. Literally, no one would have known you were dead if you actually snapped your neck in the shower. Damn. I can pull it out. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, he can medically pull it out. I use a pair of pliers. <laughs> I can... <laughs> Dang. Damn, my God. Really, really. <laughs> That's my first death. All right, people. I died. Damn. So foggy. B R E A N.
Kurt da mit. Have you found a way to counter those tanks yet? Needs all the bullets. Damn. I'm just gonna go to the corner over here and shut the fuck up. Now, dead one. You know one thing, you haven't gotten kicked off the party, huh, Brennan?
I've had too much of that for today. Fucking, <laughs> it's all over Facebook. It just won't stop. Hi there. Dang. Hi, Miss. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah, well, it's not bad. It's just. Yeah. I think we should get a dog. A big furry one that could scare off bandits but sleep next to me and keep me warm. Yeah. Yeah, but he's a comedian. You know, what do you want out of him? It's like, he shouldn't have went if he knew a comedian was going to be there because they're going to use everything they got. Yeah. Welcome to shower. May I slip on you? Ah! Oh. Why don't you have a rubber shower mat since you friggin' stand? Those little balls that sit on the, the floor. That way you got grip tape on, on your feet when you're taking a shower. Well, it didn't save you, did it? <laughs> Dude, you could have been dead in your shower. Ain't nobody would have known. <laughs> yeah. Oh, well, there you go. There goes that. That's kind of gay. Yeah, in a long time. That's kind of weird. He always calls me. Is he come back? Uh oh. Yeah. There's a problem. <laughs> but he's fine. Hmm. You know, sometimes brain goes boop. Can't do nothing about it. Hmm. He never came back. Oh, well, Brandon smokes weed in like two hours, so. Yeah, no, he finishes it pretty quickly. Nah, he just, he, he smokes so much that he's just brain dead by the time he comes back to the mic. He lost his keys and he still hasn't found them damn keys. I can't get my shovel out of his fucking closet. Can't bury anybody without my fucking shovel.
anymore. Huh. Two dollars. Afraid of mutants, huh? You're our kind of gal. It would be like an activation, though, wouldn't it? Oh, you still have those little what do you mean pets you can't open the gate? Stop playing around, Danny. I'm standing it's been a while since I've heard of it. Yeah, I, I still have those little guys. Yeah, I have Sorry, a little, uh, just a little snowman. Yeah. Ooh, just doing your job. Protecting Diamond City means keeping me out. Is that it? <laughs> oh, look, it's the Stop. report. <laughs> I'm sorry, but Mayor McDonough's really steamed, Piper. Saying that article you wrote was all lies. <laughs> let you back inside. Yeah. I told Sullivan to keep that gate shut. You devious, rabble-rousing well, really slander. Really the level but... of dishonesty in that paper okay, of you yours. Go. I'll have that printer scrapped for parts. Ooh, that a statement, Mr. McDonough? Tyrant Mayor shuts down the press. Why don't we ask the newcomer? Mm -hmm. you Always believed in freedom of the press. Oh, I... Didn't mean to bring you into this argument. <laughs> Welcome to the great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Mm -hmm. Don't let this muck. I'm sure your city is a great place. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to find someone. Trying to find <laughs> someone? Who? An infant boy. Did you say kidnapped? Well, McDonough, Diamond City Security can investigate this. How about all the other kidnapping reports you've been? Don't listen to her. Well, I'm afraid that our security... Diamond City has... A mayor of a great city. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't have time for... Damn. I've had enough of this, Piper. From now on, consider you and that little sister of yours on notice. Yeah, keep talking, McDonough. That's all you're good for. Hmm, <laughs> a big Diamond City welcome from the mayor. You feel honored yet? Look, I gotta go get settled in, but, um, stop by my office later. I have an idea for an article you'd be perfect for. Replacing people? Is your neighbor really human? Anyone is one of those things. It's that secretary of his, her and her perfect hair. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The mayor's secretary. Come on, Hi. Ma. Well, hello I there. Her myself. Another one of the poor and hair. stupid of Diamond City come begging for table scraps. Wow. Huh. There are no words. I don't care for your tone. Why don't you run along before I make a complaint with security? Bitch. What did you say? Oh, whatever. I'm done talking to you. Around here, we call your haircut endless. Is that a real vault suit? Damn. Money, she must go up. Do yourself a favor and just say yes. It's all he understands. Well, the presses are getting overloaded. That motor is going to go soon if we don't replace it. Ah, uh, you've been saying that for weeks and the old girl still keeps cranking. 
Stop worrying so much. Now I gotta head into the office. And you start whistling if you see any angry politicians coming our way. Why? Is something wrong? Hi, Bert. Paper to newcomers. It's hey, Piper. Did you grab you in the drop by? At least we warned blue. Why are you calling me that? Because of the blue jumpsuit you're wearing. You're a vault dweller. <sighs> so here's the deal. I want an interview. Your life story in print. I think it's time Diamond City had a little outside perspective on the Commonwealth. You do that, and uh, I'll tell you what. I'll come with you. Watch your back while you Ooh, get used to the yeah. world above ground. All right, Piper. I'm in. Good. Let's get down to business. So, I know you're from a vault. How would you describe your time on the inside? My family and I were frozen. I didn't spend much time in the vault. W wait, <laughs> They boxed you up in a fridge? The whole time? Are you saying you were alive before the war? Yes. I'm over 200 years old. Oh my god. The woman... Out of time. So, you've the seen the Commonwealth, my room. Diamond City. How does it compare to your old life? I think after this, I'm gonna have to stop it. I'm sorry about giving you these little bit of breaks. We didn't do much today, but we did build some stuff. I gave some people some Honestly, beds. Honestly, seeing everyone surviving out here, rebuilding the world. But I'm gonna have to get off it, here real soon. It gives um, me hope. So That's after this interview, we surprisingly and we Piper, inspired Blue. I'm shut up now. Just We're definitely quoting listen. that. Now, the big question. You came all this way looking for someone. Who is it? My baby, Sean, was kidnapped. He's not even a year old. The parent after the missing child. As heartbreaking today as it ever was. Tell me, do you suspect the Institute's involved? A man took Sean, not some shadowy group. I hope that's true. Because if they are involved, everything gets worse. For the last part of our interview, I'd like to do something different. I want you to make a statement to Diamond City directly. The threat of kidnapping is all but ignored in the Commonwealth. Everyone wants to pretend it just doesn't happen. What would you say to someone out there who's lost a loved one but might be too scared or too numb to the world to look for them? You can only take it one day at a time. Just. Keep going. 
That's all anyone can do. We're all just doing what we have to, huh? I think my readers can relate to that. That's everything. It's gonna take some time to put this all together, but I think your story is gonna give Diamond City plenty to talk about. Look, about your son. I didn't know if you were on the up and up before, didn't want to waste my friend's time, but I think he can help you. His name's Nick Valentine, a detective extraordinaire. Got an office here in Diamond City. Just look for the neon sign with the heart in it. Thanks, Piper. I'll talk to him. He'll like you. He's got a soft spot for the hard luck cases. Anyway, I agreed to come with you, right? Watch your back. Just say the word when you're ready. I can't wait to see where the story goes next. Well, looks like we got our first panel. Story of the century. And, uh... I know this wasn't much, and I kept leaving, and the doctor literally came to my house, messed with my breathing machine. Uh, I'd tell you guys to enjoy it, but y'all probably didn't. But if you did, and you liked watching it, you know, just to chill and spend some time. Thank you. Or, you know, and, uh, we'll just end here and knock the Piper. Sure. Come with me Let's go. On adventures. Do. Dog meat? I didn't even know dog meat was still with me. Oh, I, I made him sit down. I forgot all about that dude, poor guy. Hey. Hmm? And well, it'll be me and Piper going on adventures. Like I said, catch you guys in the next one. And it's your boy, Odd Adventures. Keep odd people and gals. Hope you enjoyed. Bye bye.